Hi, big boy. How you doing, buddy? How's it going, Pally Wally? I'm not leaving my desk, and you can't come up here. See you later, Gator. I love being outside and going for a walk. Whether it's sunny, foggy, or rainy. I love being outside. Okay. I just made myself some orange juice, so I'm about to get down with it. But first, I'm going to put some maca in it. Okay. I'm going to put this in there. So... I don't know if it's helping me or not. Yesterday I hardly drank any juice. I had um, two glasses of orange juice and um, what I have? Two glasses of orange juice, one glass of green juice, and two glasses of tropical cotton candy juice. If you've been watching my videos, you know what the tropical candy cotton candy juice is. And then I just drank water the rest of the day. I did a lot of stuff. I cleaned out my papers. I went for a really long walk. Um, what else? I um, did some outlining of one of my reading book, my books from from my reading list. And um, yeah. So I don't know how to explain it. I just wasn't that hungry yesterday. So today. And I also um, had a um, small elimination yesterday. Okay, um, it is the 12th day of my juice fast, and I'm getting ready to juice. Yesterday I didn't juice because I had that leftover green juice, which I only drank one uh, glass of, and I had leftover um, tropical cotton candy. But yeah, I don't know, like last night I went to bed, and I had such a productive day, but when I went to bed I watched this documentary, and it was uh, about this guy who was like a, a sex healer. It was called Sex Magic and Manifesting Maya. And um, yeah, I had some mixed uh, concerns about it. The thing that I noticed was that it was all, like, what he wanted to do was, that was the program. And, um, and all his women, right, like, he had this one girl and woman, and they were in Hawaii, and he took her to a farm. She was a raw vegan, and she wanted to get some fresh fruits and vegetables. And she was like, wait, we're leaving? But you said we could get fresh fruits and vegetables. And he was like, oh, we gotta go. When it's his agenda, it's okay, but when it's someone else's agenda, it's not okay. And then, um, one of the things that I thought was interesting was that I, I think it's difficult uh, if you're to have a relationship with one person when you are intimately involved with lots of other people. So, yeah, that was interesting. And then um, I watched Poirot. I uh, DV DVR'd the um, mystery, you know, Masterpiece Mystery. And I watched Poirot, right? And uh, for some reason, I just felt like really sad last night. I couldn't go to sleep. I kept thinking about the past, about when I was a little kid, and you know, I you know how tough it was for me when I was a little kid. How like at one point I felt like no one liked me when I was a little kid, and um, just like just like weird emotions are were coming up. Not weird emotions, but you know, stuff in the past. I can't do anything about the past. All I have right now is now. I have today, this moment, right now. And in this moment right now, I'm an adult and I can protect myself. And, um, yeah, so I don't know why I started thinking about all those, like, past hurts and all that kind of stuff. But I was. So maybe that's part of the, you know, juice fast of not eating. And someone asked me if I'm taking chia seeds, um... Does it, am I still on a juice fast? Okay, well, this is how much chia seeds I'm taking a day, you know, or if I'm still on a fast. 
Technically, I'm not on a fast. A fast is not consuming anything. But this is how much chia seeds I'm consuming a day. So I'm going to bring it up close to you so you can see how much chia seeds. Can you see that? How much chia seeds? Look. And that's to keep me regular and keep my colon clean. So if you want to clean your colon, use this much chia seeds and you will have a clean colon. I just uh, took the peel off a of lemon so I thought I might show you how to do it again. Or show you how to do it. I never showed you guys how to do this. So this is how you do it. Now it's stable. So you cut the ends off, make it stable. And then you just slice on the side, not too thick, not too... But you want to get the white off because the white is bitter. And you turn it around, slice it in, slice the sides, slice the side. Let's see where I did get. I like to get it all off. Okay. Okay, so just get the waxy off the cucumber. This cucumber didn't come from the farmer's market. It came from the store. And at the store, their cucumbers are waxy. Sometimes, uh, some stores that I go to, they don't have waxy cucumbers. But this store, they had waxy cucumbers. It was two for a dollar. And remember, when I went to the farmer's market, there were no cucumbers. The farmer's market last weekend was... I hardly used any of the stuff that I bought. You know, it was a rip-off. That's why I felt like I was ripped off, because I guess inside I knew that what I got, I wasn't really going to use or really want it. So, I'm just going to wait. I think I have to wait until, um, you know, like, well into July... For the produce to really get good and what's interesting is that this is here in the part of California where all the fruits and vegetables are grown and I'm having a hard time finding well, I wanted to show you this look what my brother made last night he made rice and as you all know rice is my favorite food he offered me some of this rice I was like I'm on a, a juice fast why would you offer me rice but look at this he has meat product in the rice where he had his chili, his spoon from his chili, and then he stuck it in the rice. I wouldn't eat it anyway. I think he's a jerk. Look at this leaf. It's a, uh, oops, a collard green leaf. Oh my God, if I were eating raw, I would love to have this uh, leaf and make a sandwich, a raw sandwich out of it or a wrap. I mean, just look at that. Beautiful. Okay, you guys, this is the beet juice that I made to cleanse my liver. Look at how vibrant that is. Can you see that? Let me see if you can see it. Oh, that is beautiful. Beet juice. Okay, now I'm going to drink it. Okay, I got to do it on camera so I won't drink it. This is the cleanse my liver.